Well, the mullahs in Iran who uh, think uh, that uh, the 12th Imam who disappeared down a well when he was a kid and can only come back if there's a nick exchange with Israel they really got their way today because I'll tell you why they got their way today because there are no surprise inspections if we want to inspect something it can be as long as 24 days or even longer uh, to see what they're doing which gives Iran plenty of time to hide stuff so scratch uh, vigorous inspections as Kerry said there aren't going to be there aren't going to be any which comes down t to uh, the fact that oh blame her <laughs> let Iran have the bomb you know what I mean and I've got a question for you liberals who are watching this if you're watching this I doubt you are but if you are if an EMP goes off over America and wipes out all our internet, wipes out all our other communications and puts us in the dark age, ages, makes it so we can't get water out of our, uh, you know, destroys all the pumps and makes it so we have to drink toilet water and stuff like that for a while uh, before we get some weird disease and then die. Um, or if it nukes Israel. Uh, will you blame a blamer finally? Or will you still blame Bush? or anyone who's not a blamer you know if that happens under this thing in the White House's uh, term or even after it thanks to this it could happen you know anytime that, I mean once the uh, Iran gets a bomb if you ask me uh, because of this deal if a nuke goes off an EMP electromagnetic pulse goes off over America or uh, Israel's nuked yeah are you going to blame Bush? Are, are you going to blame Bush still? Or will you finally blame a blamer? I would like to know. Put your comment here, okay? Bye.